I'll reboot here. It's Doc Phoenix here. I think I forgot my password for my computer. And since Windows 8 is the most advanced operating system and cannot be penetrated, uh, I don't think I will be able to reset the password unless you've been reading the reboot pro forms. So this user over here created a tutorial on how to reset the uh, passwords on Windows 8 without using third-party software. Now, uh, but by the time you see this, Windows might have a security patch for it. But if you've just freshly installed your uh, Windows and you've got your password, I'm going to show you now how to remove the password without using third-party software. So, first of all, what you would require is a, an actual Windows 8 machine to be able to reset the password. The first thing that we're going to do is create a recovery disk. So all you do at the start screen, um, just type in REC, uh, it should be somewhere on settings, it says recovery, open up recovery, then you click on create recovery disk. And then you can either have a flash drive that you have inside, but what I'm going to do is uh, create a system repair disk with a CD or DVD instead. So you just click on that and it should ask you um, which drive you want to create a disk with. Since I already did this previously, I'm just going to load it up quickly. Once it's been created, it should look more or less something like this here. So we're just going to restart the system now and then boot into that disk. Once you've booted into your um, newly created recovery disk, you just select your language, uh, click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then command prompt. Okay, so what you want to do is locate the drive where Windows is installed onto. So what you type in is disk port and then you type in list ball and this will show you all of the drives that's currently available. So usually the biggest drive is the drive that um, that you want to try to access. Type in exit to exit arrow. Uh, disk part. So what you do is type in D uh, colon and then enter and then you type DIR and then you make sure that your Windows directory is here as you can see there. So to go to the Windows directory you type in CD Windows and then go uh, to System 32. First, make backups of the files that we're going to be working with. Type in copy cmd. Dot e. X e. And then you just give it a backup name. Cmd. Dot e. X e. Dot o. L. D and then you type enter and the next file that you're going to um, back up utilman it's uh, u t i l m a n now you're going to delete the original utilman and replace it with uh, cmd you say d e l utilman enter and then what you do is rentmd.exe and you're going to rename it to YouTube man so additionally what you want to do is rename your cmd back into an original cmd so you can use it to log into the administrator account so you're going to say copy cmd.exe.old to cmd.exe now you're set up for the hack. You just close and turn off the PC and then start up the computer again.
if you don't have a Windows 8 machine that's working you can always just boot up from your uh, Windows 8 installation disk and when you boot it up to this screen and you press um, shift key and F10 a command prompt should also appear and you must just follow the same procedure as with the other method and now when you at your lock screen you just swipe it and I cannot access the computer again so you just go to the bottom here where the ease of access manager is you click on it and then suddenly you've got a command prompt from this command prompt you can run several commands that will enable you to reset the username password or uh, create uh, additional users or access the administrator account okay so the first thing that I'm going to do is try to access the administrator account using net user administrator and then slash active colon yes type enter and then you should, when you reboot the computer you should have access to your administrator account so let's see if that works and there the, the administrator account is now unlocked once you've accessed your uh, administrator account you can access the control panel click on large icons scroll down to user accounts and click on manage another account from here you will be able to change the password alternatively if someone changed your administrator password you can open up your pack tutorial type in net user the accounts name of the password that you want to change and then start it will ask you for a password just remember it will not show uh, any action as you're typing it in and you should be able to log in with that new password now to reverse the changes that you made you go to your desktop type uh, on windows key and x run command prompt as admin if the user account control comes up just uh, accept it type in net user administrator active colon no this will remove the administrator account from the user login and you can run sfc scan now to replace all the files that you just changed so thank you for watching goodbye